I'm going to try and illustrate just how simple it will be for a customer to have to replace the any of these the generators the bearing or the gears when it's on the turbine so you, this is obviously the quick little prototype i've got right now pull this off <laughs> there we go when this is on the turbine i don't know if i'm gonna go like this or this way we go up to quad so it wouldn't matter but when this is bolted on the turbine customer can just come through just unbolt the screws around this plate and just pull this off so they can do any kind of work on the generator really simply on a desk desk or a table um set this aside they need to replace a gear here they can do that they need to replace the motor just unscrew these the motor slides right out from the back here there's nothing obstructing it Need to replace the gear, undo there. You need to replace a bearing. You can unscrew this. These, the bearing, I'm gonna have it switch to this side for the final one, but you just unscrew these. The bearing slides off. You can change the gear by undoing these screws, pulling that off. You go back on all of it. The turbine will never have to leave its case. So they, a customer could completely replace bearings, gears, or the powerhouse, or change what kind of motors they want. If they want to do different ones, they want to go to a different gear unit, they can buy a different gear hub that can be pulled off too. Um, change different motors, anything they want. It's like super, super modular. And we can just sell different plates that have different motor mounts. We can do up to four on this one at least. I think you can fit about four of them on the sides here. So we can get up to, uh, was it 12 volt at 12 volts we can do up to six kill or you know sorry 12 volts we can do up to 12 kilowatts at 24 volts we can do up to uh 24 kilowatts super simple and when they want to replace it so it'll be inside this vacuum chamber if a customer needs to they just break the vacuum pull the chamber off the top the turbine will just be open like this inside unbolt this work on it put this back on bolt everything down just literally put the chamber back on top pull the vacuum turn around again what do you think